Good day, brethren. You are welcome to our CCG New Covenant Parishes Open Heavens Daily Devotional. The Open Heavens Daily Devotional is written by our Father and the Lord, the General of of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, Pastor E. Adeboye. And I pray that as you join me today, God will bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Today, 1st of October 2024, we are looking at the topic, Prayers for Your Nation. I remember verses taken from Second Chronicles 7.14, which says, If my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Our text is taken from Psalm 22, from verses 27 to 28. All the ends of the world shall remember and turn unto the Lord, and all the kindreds of the nations shall worship before thee. For the Lord is for the kingdom is the Lord's and is the governor among the nations. So today we are going to be praying and we have a couple of prayer points. And I pray that as we express our hearts to God, God will answer us speedily in Jesus' name. Our first prayer point says, Father, I am grateful for your blessings over my nation. We are still standing because you are watching over us. Let us talk to God. Father, we are grateful for your blessings over our nations. Thank you because our nations are still standing because you are interested in us. Thank you because you are still watching over us. If not, our countries would have imploded. But Lord God Almighty, you have been faithful to us and our nation. We say to you, be all the glory. We are grateful in Jesus' name. Let's say, Father, please empower the leaders of my nation and grant them the wisdom and strength to lead us aright at all times. Father, empower the leaders of our nation to lead us aright at all times in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, please empower the leaders of our nation, Lord, to lead us with your wisdom and to lead us to do the right thing in the name of Jesus. Let's talk to God and say, Lord, please expose and not put wicked leaders from their offices in Jesus' name. Never let the wicked rule in any part of my nation again in the name of Jesus. Lord, we are asking, Lord, that you uproot, you expose and you uproot every wicked leader in government, in power, in our nations in the name of Jesus. Lord, those who are wicked, those who are, are, are bringing suffering to the masses, Father, expose and uproot them and never let the wicked rule again in any part of our countries in the name of jesus let's talk to god and say father please give the righteous people in my nation the boldness to rule raise righteous people who will boldly take up the mantle of leadership in the name of jesus father raise righteous people up to rule people like joseph people like daniel in our own times people that will rule so that the people may rejoice in the name of jesus lord give the righteous people boldness to run for office to get into elected positions, to get into leadership positions in the name of Jesus. Lord, raise people who boldly take up the mantle of leadership in the name of Jesus. Let's talk to God and say, Lord, please let your mercy reign in my nation. Let there be no disasters or outbreaks of diseases in the name of Jesus. Lord, let mercy prevail in my nation. Let there be no disaster, dis- disasters. Let there be no outbreak of diseases. Keep us safe in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, keep us safe in the name of Jesus. I say, Father, please let my nation prosper greatly. Let our lands be filled with abundance and let our economies blossom. Open new doors of opportunities and prosperity to us. Let barrenness and scarcity come to an end in every part of my nation in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we ask that you let our nations prosper greatly in the name of Jesus. Let our nations prosper greatly. Let our land be filled with abundance. Let our land be filled with plenty. Let there be new doors of opportunities open. Let there be prosperity for each and every one of our citizens in the name of Jesus. Let's talk to God and say, Father, please let peace reign between us and the nations around us. War and violence of any kind will not be mentioned in our land in Jesus' name. Father, let peace reign. Let peace reign. Let peace reign between us and all the countries around us and countries around the world. Lord, let there be no violence in our nations. Let there be no violence in our land in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's talk to God and say, Father, Please let your plans for my nation be fulfilled. Let them come to pass quickly in Jesus' name. Father, let your plans for my nation be fulfilled in the mighty name of Jesus. Let them come to pass quickly in the mighty name of Jesus. Let your plans for my nation be fulfilled. Let them come to pass quickly in the name of Jesus. Let's say, Lord, please have mercy and cause us to repent from any form of pride and foolishness that may destroy us in our nation in the name of Jesus. Lord, help us to repent of any pride and foolishness that may destroy us in the name of Jesus. We know pride leads to destruction. Every form of pride, every form of haughty spirit, Father, Lord God Almighty, will reject them in our lives in the mighty name of Jesus. 
Let's talk to God and say, Lord, please let my nation be among the great nations of the world. Let those seeking to destroy my nation and steal our glory be brought to shame in the name of Jesus. Lord, let my nation be among the, the great nations of the world. Let my nation be a force to reckon with. Let those seeking to destroy and steal the glory of my nation, let them be brought to shame in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's talk to God and say, Lord, please let there be a revival in my nation. Let it begin. Let us begin to seek you latterly in Jesus' name. Father, let the revival break forth in the, my nation, in the name of Jesus. Let there be revival in my nation. Let people begin to seek you all heartedly. Let people begin to hunger and thirst for you in the mighty name of Jesus. And lastly, your personal prayer points for your nation. We ask that my nation will prosper. My nation will excel. My nation will be great in the mighty name of Jesus. We ask that you prosper us. You move us forward. Let there be peace in the land. Let there be prosperity in the land in the name of Jesus. Turn the heart of everyone to you in Jesus' name. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Thank, thank you, Heavenly Father, for the prayer points that we have prayed. We ask, Lord, that you answer them speedily in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you very much. God bless you. <music>